morning, everybody. John's Adventures is in Richmond, Kentucky this morning. We're going to be taking you around and showing you Richmond, which is about 30 miles south of Lexington on I-75. And uh, right now we're at A&W A Root Beer, one of my favorite places. Unfortunately, they don't have one in Greenville, but uh, whenever I'm out of town and I can find a and w I always make the point to go there. Richmond, Kentucky has a livability score according to area vibes of 76, which is really high. That means it's a great place to live and raise a family. Let's go ahead and uh, get over here to the mall. We're going to show you the new mall they have. And then we're... Now this is the new mall. It's called the Richmond Center. We're going to take a look at some of that. Then we'll move on to other parts of town. Richmond is a really cool town. Perfect size, 36,000, not too big, not too small. We're going to start here at Logan's Roadhouse. Walking on it. This mall is spread out, kind of like a small city. Not a, not the typical mall that I, you think I would be talking about where you can walk indoors and shop, but this thing is spread out over lots of acres. I'd say there's acres and acres here of stores, just one right behind the other. Anyway, all this looks new to me and so if you're looking for good shopping Richmond certainly has that just about any kind of store you could want to go to as you can see as we're driving around uh, turn in here Myers. yes show you the main part of the mall the Michael Jacks Michael all the way down to Casey Penney's you have Oh, I thought you were going to drive a bit. Of course, they have J.C. Penney's, Michael's, and we'll go on around. We'll show you some more. Bed and Body Works, Cinemax Movie Theater. As far as you can see in every direction, you can turn their stores. So this is, as I said, it's more like a small city. There's everything here you could imagine you could want. And it just goes on and on and on. Right beyond the stores, I-75, so Richmond has easy access. Just hop off of 75, and you can be in the middle of Richmond and everything going on here in just a matter of minutes. Shops, restaurants, movies, you name it, it's here. Right, this is a little park. It, uh, my friend was telling me that in the warmer months that they perform concerts here with the public and they can sit around and listen to some good music. And of course, you're looking at Buffalo Wild Wings. It's all right here at the Richmond Mall. Anytime you're in Richmond, Kentucky, be sure I come by and check this thing out. It's worth looking at. We're going to continue our tour of Richmond, Kentucky. Get on over there and cross the street and show you some more things. Then we're going to head downtown toward Eastern Kentucky University and the old part of town. Of course, you're in a new part of town now. It seems like a lot of the towns in America, the smaller towns, have a new part and the old part. So then we're going to show you the old part of town that was here, I'm sure, long before this was. Eastern Kentucky University. You're looking at the entrance sign. So, Richmond is not only a cool town, but it's a college town. Eastern Kentucky University, undergraduate enrollment of around 12,000. We're at the entrance to Eastern Kentucky. We're gonna roll through and show you some of the campus. There's the football stadium the center of activity on campus, I'm sure. Can I see it? I'm trying.
as the sun sets on this beautiful city park in Richmond, Kentucky, we're going to close out our adventure in Kentucky and in Richmond at this beautiful park. As you're looking at the lake now, I've been a couple times here already and I've fallen in love with it. I like to thank the many people of Kentucky that I've had a chance to meet while I was here. Charlotte Newsom, a friend and subscriber who's been kind enough to spend her time taking me around and showing me the beautiful things in Kentucky and in Richmond. I encourage you to get out and travel as much as you can. See these beautiful cities in America. Visit our beautiful country. Talk to our people. We have great people here. We are so blessed to live in a country like this. That's why everybody in the world wants to come to America. That's the reason we have a wonderful country. We have wonderful people. Always appreciate your country. Support it. Appreciate it. Love it. And be out in it as much as you can. I'm so glad I'm an American. I'm so glad I have great friends. I'm so glad I have great subscribers. You guys mean everything to me. Thank you so much for watching my videos. If you enjoy them and you're new to the channel, we appreciate it. If you would consider subscribing, if you're a return viewer, we thank you for watching. So right as the sun is setting now, we're going to close out our adventure. We'll be heading back to our home state in North Carolina soon. And we'll see you on the next adventure. God bless.